Right, guys and girls, and I'm just making sure. Yep, it's working, it should be working. Now, anyway, welcome back. It is Friday, the 3rd of December 2021, at the time of the video. I am playing uh, some of the new Call of Duty game. We have actually got the settings. If I go to the graphical settings, actually, we've got the controller on. The horizontal sensitivity and all that to about four it seems okay if i think we'll just put it up to five and see what happens but um i've got the hertz refresh rate to because then the what's it called this new um projector can do it to 240 hertz and i thought i'd test that out on here and I've whacked it to 120. Your hardware must support 120 hertz signal for it to uh, do. Um, so depth of field, I think. Oh, got that on 110. I think I was going to try and put. Actually, I'll put it on 120. See what happens. See if there's anything on there. But um, I'm record. I think I'm recording this. In 4K, but I'm not too sure because I've put it to 4K on the PS5. I shall keep it to 100, and, yeah, 110, because um, that will bring up the frame rate a lot lower and all that to try and keep it to the 100 refresh rate of the monitor or the screen, I should say, um, of the projector itself. Now, this projector is the View Sonic 701. Uh, a friend of mine who does YouTube videos as well, he's got the exact one um, I've just sort of got here. And we're just doing, I'm doing basically uh, a test on here to see what this entire thing is. But well, at the moment, first of all, we're going to set up some loadouts. Because that STG, I mean, it's okay-ish, but I don't know. I think I need something really fast. Submachine guns, maybe? MP, oh, MP40. Obviously, this is like a World War II style game, so, um, there's too much rapid fire on that one. Firepower is, like, um, really low. And these ones come with ammo. Um, might make us another class for that, actually. Because uh, at the moment... I'm setting up my shotgun combat class and see how well this does. And I actually didn't know on the PS5 itself um, that this um, controller, the PS5 controller with your sense and stuff in it, it's actually got a built in mic and this is one I'm actually using right now. So I'm just testing out the quality of the microphone. Um, so we're going to put Ninja on that one, and uh, obviously we've got, uh, don't know when to put, enemies have behind a footprint, trail C markers at the enemies, uh, we'll just keep that one on, radar, enemies appear on minimap where they fire an unsilenced weapon, so if it's unsilenced weapons, it'll show up, uh, oh, I don't know what to put on, double tap, Double tap, is that double tap to, of tactical sprint, increased crouch movement and speed by 30%. Demolition, extra lethal. Now, I'll probably keep that one to double tap. I'm wondering if they've got any... Uh, what's that? Gammon Bonds explodes on impact. Ah, okay. And what's this one here? Smoke grenades, stun grenades. So, we'll just keep that for a minute, and what we're going to use is the rat um, pistol. Um, my, I've got a sniper rifle set up as well. Um, type 99, I think it's a, is that a sniper. Yeah, that's a sniper. Actually, any better ones yet? Uh, three line rifle, or the Car 98K. That's actually the one I got the toy version on, the Car 98K. Uh, we'll just keep that one, and we'll make a, that's it, that one, that's a shotgun, that's a combat shotgun, I'll keep that one there, 
And so what else should we have? Submission. Oh, I'll get the MP40 because I used to love the MP40 back in Call of Duty Black Ops 1. Uh, well, I'm getting attachments for it yet, so we'll leave that. And we'll do Ninja uh, Radar and Double Tap like we've been doing. Uh, Gammon Bomb and 60 Stun Grenades. Okay. Challenges. Actually, what about field upgrades? Kill streaks. Oh, so we haven't even unlocked the kill streaks yet. Okay. Um, well, we'll just keep those ones for the time being because we don't think we can unlock the, any of these yet. Or can we? No, we can't unlock those yet. Uh, Right, so what we'll do, we'll um, try and play this at 120 frames per second, or whatever the refresh rate is. All right. Let's see how well we do. Uh, I don't know, what's this one? What's the tokens I've got? Uh, double XP. Yeah, we'll get double XP. How about that for an hour or something? Oh, what's this? What's this? Oh, Team Deathmatch. Dome. Combat shotgun, just in case it might be included. Oh, Alright, let's do it. This is the word. Oh, was that? Shoot for the price of one then. Oh, shit. Jesus, shitting everybody up here. Prize from bombs away. Did I get anyone? Oh, I got one. Oh, someone come here. Oh, spawn 
killed. Nice. Okay. Anyway, guys, it goes. That was just a short clip of what I put together. Let me just go around shooting the other guys up and trying to get some of the um, guns together. And um, with the 120 hertz refresh rate on this 4K um, thing, it's got a, fan, a decent fan in it as well. So it's sort of keep blowing all the hot air out. Um, the quality on the picture though is absolutely good. I will probably do a uh, review on this uh, projector and everything on it. But anyway guys and girls, with the PS5 and the projector and the HDR and the 4K, obviously I've got it in 10, I think it's 1080p, 240Hz. So... Obviously, when you're doing, like, gaming mode on there and stuff, you've got to sort of, like... I mean, obviously, I like refresh rate faster and low latency, which is good. So, it doesn't matter if it's 1080p with low latency and high refresh rate of 120 hertz. Because it's quicker than to do the, the shooting to people and try and get them quicker and all that before they get you. But at least I showed you some of the, sort of, clip on it. Um, a video on it, but anyway guys and girls stay safe. This is Vanguard. This is the Call of Duty Vanguard on PlayStation 5 the PS5 version and I'll see you on the next episode guys and girls might do some more live stream later on today or tonight in the morning, but should be good Stay safe and see you soon